So I might start out like this. Hey John, we got the proposal put together. By the way, there's not going to be any mystery here. You've already seen the price. It's what brought you in. So there isn't mystery like it used to be. The last time you bought a car, you didn't know what was going to show up on that piece of paper. And that's why you had to fight for a fair price. Well, you got that before you ever walked on the lot. However, the Audi Q5, um, first of all, because there's no such thing as a good deal on the wrong car, that is the right car for you, correct? Yeah. You love the way it drove? Yes, I do. You said it's equipped just the way it had to be equipped? Yeah. Absolutely. Yes, okay. <laughs> now, I want to remind you that you don't just get the Audi, okay? There's a lot more coming with it. As a matter of fact, you're going to get a six-year, 100,000-mile comprehensive warranty with that Audi because it's Audi certified. What's that mean to you? It means you're not going to pull any money out of your pocket for in, in an automobile repair for the, dist, or for the uh, foreseeable future, okay? Maybe for the life of the vehicle. You're going to get key replacement. Those keys are about 450 bucks to replace. You're going to get a year's worth of key coverage on us, okay? No cost to you at all. And by the way, you can always extend that, and I certainly suggest that you do if you plan on keeping the vehicle. You're also going to get paintless dent repair. Now, what's paintless dent repair? We talked about it earlier, but let me remind you. Um, most people, when they get a ding or a dent in their vehicle, and almost everybody does, I mean, they get mad as a hornet. They'd like to find the son of a gun that did it and strangle him. Um, and then they go on about their, their merry way. They don't go seek out a paintless dent repair uh, shop to have the dent fixed. But you know what? They do pay for it because... When it's time to trade or sell it, someone's going to deduct from the value of their vehicle because of the dings and dents. You're not going to have to pay for the repairs for the next year, okay? If you get one or you get 101 dings or dents that can be repaired by that process, we are going to fix those for you at absolutely no cost to you. Now, what's that going to do? It's going to lower your cost of ownership and increase your resale value, which drives down the total investment. You're going to get a loaner vehicle when you bring it in for service. All right, I don't think this applies, but if you so desired, you could bring that sucker back during the first 72 hours. Don't put more than 300 additional miles on the odometer, but you could bring it back and exchange it. And most importantly, I told you about our best value guarantee a while back, and here's the way I describe it. You can't pay too much for a vehicle at Bomberito. It's impossible. Because what did I tell you we'd do if you found a similar vehicle with the same benefits we offer anywhere on the planet within the next 10 days? No, I didn't say that. I said we would cut you a check for the difference. If you found that vehicle advertised for less money, and it was a similar, it doesn't have to be exactly the same, it's got to be very similar, and it's got the same benefits that we offer, and it's advertised for less money, show us the ad, we'll cut you a check on the spot for the difference. So you can't pay too much for the vehicle, okay? Now, this vehicle started out at $33,900. It's been discounted $2,000, so you own it for $31,900. After your tag and your fees, the total comes down to $32,194. Now, what we've done over here, John, is we've done what our customers have asked us to do for years. We've given you choices. Right here, I'm going to show you a higher payment than anybody else in St. Louis will. However, that payment will save you a pile of money. It will allow you to build equity faster, and it will allow you to pay it off sooner. Okay? The payment of 36 months with Zero down is this. However, before we go, in, go into all these payments, let me ask you a question. Um, if you don't like any of these payments, you can put down more than $5,000. We're not going to stop you. But at this point in time, which of these cash downs would be most interesting to you? Which one would you like to do? Zero, three, or five? Three. Okay. Let's just focus right here then, all right? At 36 months, the payment would be 800 and some odd dollars. I can't see it, but you probably can. Um, now, again... That's a high, higher payment that you may have been anticipating, but it would save you, well, about $1,300 versus this much lower payment at 60 months, which is in the 500s. Now, this payment's obviously way more comfortable because it's lower, but it's also, John, more flexible because you want to save money, you want to pay it off sooner, you want to build equity faster, you could always do that in your own time frame. There is no prepayment penalty. So while this one saves you money, this one's more comfortable, it's also more flexible. And the 48-month payment, that's sort of the best of both worlds. Payment's a little bit lower than it would be at 36, a little bit higher than it would be at 60, but you save some money, build equity faster, and you get the title sooner. So do me a favor, put a check mark by the payment, one of those three, okay that right there so we can get the new Audi ready for delivery.
Thirty one nine, I don't know. I mean the mole of this seems a little high. Okay. Thirty one nine and I realize, but boy, that seems like a lot of money for that Q five. Hey, John, the, the fact that you'd like a lower price is evidence that you're a perfectly normal human being, okay? And quite frankly, you're doing what you've always done when you bought a car. You look at the numbers and you say, hey, that can't be the best deal because no dealer ever gives you the best deal on the first pass, if you will. And your thinking is absolutely correct if it was three, four, or five years ago. But remember, we had a conversation about an hour and a half ago. We talked about how you bought your last car, how you had to go back and forth, how you had to fight tooth and nail to get yourself a fair price, okay? Um, and I told you that those days were gone. Believe me, we miss them, but those days are gone, and they're gone forever. The discount you used to have to fight for, John, I'd say you got it before you ever set foot on the lot. You won. As soon as you got out of your car and put your foot down on this property, you had won because the price that we put out there, by the way, at one time it was at 33.9, so we had to discount at 2,000 even from there. And I promised you two things. John, I promised you that uh, we'd have fun today, that we could focus on the vehicle, nothing else. And I also promised you the fastest purchase of your entire life. John, you're slowing us down right now. I need you okay right there. I like that part. <laughs> Customers are going to complain or object to our price because we've taught them to. Mm -hmm. But if you can say, well, wait a minute, we had this discussion, dog on it, I appreciate that, but you're slowing us down, I told you to be fast, you got a huge discount in order to get you here, um, let's do it. Let's don't dawdle. We can do one or two things. We can sit here and stare at each other for a while, or I can go get your, uh, Q, uh, your Q5 ready for delivery so you can enjoy it. Which would you rather do? Most people don't want to stare at me, okay? <laughs> there's a lot prettier things around here to look at, your car being one of them. I mean, there's so many different ways you can go. And by the way, if you want to, if you want to save money, John, I told you by going 36 months, you save $1,300. Why don't you just do that? Is money important to the customer? Sure it is. Is price important? Absolutely. I, 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 anybody that tells you that they got a selling strategy that'll make price go away, they're a liar. Price doesn't go away. 20% of the people in this country are going to buy based, based strictly on price. They're not going to give a damn about the paintless dent repair. They're not going to give a damn about the key replacement. They're not going to give a damn about the warranty. If it ain't the cheapest one they can find, they're not going to buy it. But that's only 20% of the people. And most of us salespeople seem to dwell on that 20%. We seem, we seem to remember those people as opposed to the 80% who are subject to paying a little bit more if we show them the value.